my name is Anthony Opus from Uganda Red Cross Society, and I'm privileged once more to share my views with Limitless about my strength. I am a leader, and through my leadership engagements in my community and at school, they have shaped me to who I am. And I hold the values of love, empathy, equity, among others. And I hold the motivation that our communities can be self-sustaining in that they can contribute to the development of the country. And uh, my innovation idea is empowerment of young girls to fight against the vice of teenage pregnancies. And currently in my community, over 5,000 girls were registered pregnant during lockdown, a means that was used to stem the spread of the coronavirus. And up to date, several, many teenage girls still continue to get pregnant. And this can be stopped. And it's a reason as to why I've shared these views with Limitless. Thank you. Thank you once more. My name is Anthony Opus. Uh, when designing my prototype, uh, I used tools like the design thinking framework for innovation, uh, the map, uh, among several other tools. Uh, having witnessed the problem of teenage pregnancies myself, uh, I empathized with the affected girls, most especially the teenage school going girls. And uh, in my community, over 5,000 girls were registered pregnant during lockdown, a means that was used to stem the spread of the coronavirus. And that prompted me to think of the possible solution to this problem. And I thought of empowering girls uh, both economically and also imparting with them the necessary knowledge that they need to know in order for them to fight this problem of teenage pregnancies. And in our economic empowerment campaigns, we taught girls how to make reusable sanitary pads and uh, or also skill them with uh, tailoring skills. And uh, in our educative campaigns, we were able to, to collaborate with the medical personnel and uh, who took them through uh, sex education and the health-related impacts of early pregnancy and also uh, how to keep their hygiene. And uh, the value proposition of this project is that we shall have a reduced number of teenage pregnancies. And uh, since girls will be empowered, they will be able to fight this vice. And uh, among the stakeholders involved in this project include the local government and uh, we also have the forum for african women educationalists and ngo that supports the culture and the foundation for resilience and community empowerment thank you thank you once again uh, after testing my prototype i came up with the following findings first and foremost so many young girls do not have knowledge on sex education and they do not have knowledge on the health consequences related to early pregnancies and uh, i also came to learn that so many young girls lack financial support for their basic needs for example sanitary pads and they do not have the skill sets that empower them economically like tailoring among other skills like hairdressing and uh, uh, the future impact of my project is that if these women are empowered if they have the economic empowerment with the skill sets for tailoring and addressing, among others, and they are imparted with the knowledge of the consequences related to early pregnancies and the health, education, and hygiene, then they will be able to fight against this vice of teenage pregnancies and therefore build up families that are, are, are able to generate high household incomes and better livelihoods. And uh, if given chance for more funding from Limitless, I pledge to carry out sustainable educative campaigns through partnership with the district local government. And uh, I also plan to establish training centers for empowerment of girls with the skill sets like hairdressing, tailoring, and um, making of reusable sanitary pads, among several other skill sets. And uh, I will also engage the community more regularly by having radio talk shows. And uh, also the economic activities should be uh, geared towards making uh, activities like educative campaigns and engagement with the community more sustainable. If we are able to generate this money with the youth, 
then it will be able to sustain the other activities of the project. Thank you.